Are you still finding ways to avoid your fears? Are you still trying to overcome your fears? Or are you ready to transform your fears into love? Hi everyone, I'm Rona and welcome to Me and You. Where the aim is not to follow one another but walk together into the world of Disney inspiration where I share my reflections and introspective insights on a Disney inspired quote and I wish you to the same. Find out what meaning the quote holds for you in your life. For inspirational quotes are like pieces of puzzle. It's up to us to find out where it fits in our puzzle of life in order to find our bigger picture in life. And so to all the newcomers as I welcome you to this channel, I hope you're ready to put on your introspective glasses as you begin your journey within. For that which comes from within has far more greater impact than any other outside influences that we surrounded with today. And the first step in beginning any journey in life is to believe in it. So I truly hope that you take out some time to deeply ponder upon the previous quotes step by step for just as each door is connected to the other to form a bigger picture, each quote is connected to the other to help you form your bigger picture in life. I put the links to the videos in the description box below. For those who have already begun, I welcome you once again. So let's begin with our 6th step in our 10 steps to manifesting our dream life, the Disney way, with the quote by Walt Disney himself. I only hope that we never lose sight of one thing, that it was all started by a mouse. It was his ability to transform that which he feared, the fear of mouse, into creating the most loving, iconic character ever created, that of Mickey Mouse, which is still alive in the hearts of billions of people today, even after 90 years of its creation. Even though Walt Disney himself is no longer there, Mickey is still alive in all of our hearts. Such is the power of love. And so, as I was introspecting on this quote, and I hope you do too as we walk together today, the first question that came to my mind was, what is fear? As simple a question as it seemed, it had me reflecting for a long, long time. And the more I probed in, I realized that while I was aware of all that which I feared, I actually didn't know what fear was. And so as I found myself digging deep within to understand its nature, I found that fear was a force. It was a force which expressed itself in different ways, through different forms in every aspect of life, at times tangible and at times intangible and silent. It was a driving force that governed a lot of human actions and behaviors. And that's when I knew I had to find out how deep its roots were in my life. And so the next question that came to me was, what are some of the fears that I have been living with and how have I been dealing with them? And as I was introspecting on, on it, I found that fears of all kinds had silently creeped in in almost every aspect of my life. From fear of certain insects and animals to fear of water and heights to fear of public speaking and crowds, to fear of certain people, and it went on and on. But these were just some of the known tangible fears and I had found ways to deal with them. And no matter what all fears we each live with, I am sure a lot of you can resonate with me when I say that I dealt with my fears in three ways. At times take the easiest way out and that was to avoid all that which I feared. At times face them reluctantly and unwillingly. There were times when I gathered enough courage to try and overcome them, at times succeeding and at times not. But it was only as I was introspecting on this quote that I found out that there were this whole load of intangible fears which were silent and more powerful. Unseen fears that had entered my life without me being even aware of them. Fear of not being enough Fear of not having enough. Fear of not being in control. Fear of the unknown. Fear of not failure but fear of success. Fear of loneliness. Fear of death. And as these fears came to surface, I was shocked to realize how these fears cropped up even more fears 
it was a force and it was a dark force which was governing a lot of my actions and behaviors so the next question that came to me was where did this fears come from where did this fears come from in the first place while i was aware of all that which i feared while i knew how to deal with them i actually had no idea where did this fears come from and as i found myself digging deep within i realized that when doubts set in fears creep in when doubts in one self sets in fears of all kinds creep in and so the next obvious question was how do i remove these doubts what do i replace them with and as i was reflecting on it i found that while on one end of the spectrum lies doubt lies on the other end trust when trust sets in love comes in when trust in one's self sets in love comes in and there is no room for fear left anymore but then the only question that came to me was how do i trust myself for so long i've only doubted myself and allowed fears to creep in and that's when i once more realized the importance of introspection the importance of these introspective videos for they were not only a direct reflection of the voice of my heart but a direct expression of the force of love within that lay underneath the layers of doubts and fears helping me once again regain the trust within to cite an example i have always had this fear of public speaking so much so that i have always avoided doing a lot of things that required public speaking it's held me back from doing a lot of things that i've always wanted to do but for the fear of that i've not done that up until now when i ventured into the world of disney inspired jewelry and i began reading on disney inspiration and finding out how it all fit into my puzzle of life and one fine day i decided to take the step of courage and get in front of a camera and post an introspective video to the whole world while posting a video today on social media is one form of public speaking it was a big step for me but i was so glad that i took that step for in the process i found out that i enjoy creating these videos i love getting in front of the camera and talking to the whole world sharing my reflections and introspective insights on these quotes but at the same time not advising and teaching them for that which comes from within has powers to turn fears into love and that's when i finally understood that the only way to remove fears in life was not to avoid them was not to face them was not to overcome them for that only acknowledged and strengthened them even more the only way to remove fears in life was to transform them into the most powerful force the force of love just like walt disney had and that's when i also realized that each disney quote was a stepping stone down the rabbit hole within leading me to yet another quote to yet another stepping stone down the rabbit hole within bringing to surface all the cracks and holes that lay within and while public speaking is a vast genre and i still have a long way to go while fears in other aspects of my life are still around and i still have a long way to go i am so glad i took that first step down the rabbit hole within for every adventure requires taking a first step which is going to be the basis for my next video but for now as we each reflect and introspect on this quote and some of the fears in our lives the question that we need to be asking ourselves is are we still finding ways to avoid our fears are we still trying to overcome our fears or are we willing and ready to transform our fears into love I thank you very much for walking with me today. I truly hope that you take out some time to deeply ponder upon this quote for this will be the beginning of a whole new adventure for you. 
I would love to hear your reflections and introspective insights in the comment section below. If you found this video helpful, do like and share it with like-minded people. If you would like to join me on this introspective journey within, do click on that rock with me button and press on that notification bell so you're notified each time I upload a video. Until next time, I thank you very much.